being an entrepreneur can definitely come with its own set of disappointments. And there are going to be times when you're going to most definitely need encouragement. It is important that you have a circle around you of people that can encourage you, but you don't want to be solely dependent upon that. You definitely want to be able to encourage yourself and then continue to encourage yourself when things happen and you get hit. already know how important it is to speak over our life and our business the things that we want to see manifest it's also important to be able to visualize it as well so you want to be able to visualize the things that you want to see happen in your life before they ever happen one way that you can do this is by having a vision board. We've all heard of it. Um, old school, cut out magazine pictures, glue them to a board. And there's nothing wrong with that. I find it quicker and easier to do pictures like, and print them out instead. But whatever method you're going to use, I want you to personalize those images. So for instance, on my vision board several years ago, um, one of the things that I wanted was long, thick, healthy natural hair and so I found a picture of a young lady cut it out but then I glued my face on top of her so that I could see myself with that long thick healthy natural hair and even though I still have some inches I want to achieve on this hair baby baby this is all me there is no weave or tracks or relaxers or anything like that so i was able to achieve that goal of healthy natural hair and that has happened with so many other things in my life as well so having a vision board or even a vision wall which is what i have done i have a vision wall so the images that you're seeing are going to be images of my vision wall and if you want to see how i did that i'll definitely include the playlist down below where i show you how i made the frame the artwork and everything that you see like those floating frames I actually made those I didn't buy them so all of that is covered in that playlist for that DIY vision wall so you can do a vision board a vision wall but whichever it combine it with the motivation so you can just be motivated by it you can have motivational tips you can have a motivation board there was a time in my life where i was so negative y'all just so negative and so i had to have a motivation board to really encourage myself but you want to have that another thing that you can do is turn the artwork in your house into something motivating so this is the first thing that i see when i open my bedroom door every morning morning and all I did was take some motivational quotes that I really like and create this art piece so now it's an art piece that is also motivating me so it's kind of twofold and if you want to see how I created this piece which is super easy and inexpensive just go ahead and like this video and if we get enough thumbs up I'll definitely film the DIY for you guys for one of my Saturday DIYs on how I did that Another thing that I do to stay motivated is I have post-it notes. You we all have post-it notes, so I have them everywhere. So I have six things that I'm currently working on um, and I just want to be, you know, really concentrated on and I wrote those on a post-it note. And I put one on my computer screen because I know I'm going to look at it every day on my TV so that if at the end of the day I sit down in my bedroom to watch TV and I haven't done one of those six things that's that reminder as well as on my bathroom mirror so I have it all over in my planner I have motivational quotes to start the month the week I take an index card and I write down a scripture that I'm meditating on and how I can apply it to my life and that is in my planner on my laptop I also have a scripture and I use that to encourage myself because it's hard being an entrepreneur and I would get scared. I still have those moments when I get scared. And so I just need to know that God is always with me. So that encourages me. In addition to that, I have my, what I refer to as WMD, my weapons of mass destruction. And that is the word of God. And so I have that in different notes. I use Evernote, but I have it on um, feeling discouraged when you need motivation, when you're feeling sick. I have one on salvation if I have to minister and all of these different topics. So that whatever I'm feeling, I have scripture already at hand that's God's word that I can read and reflect on because I wasn't blessed with the ability to just memorize it I don't just remember it so being able to reflect back on those scriptures definitely helped me now I know you're probably thinking like oh my gosh that's a lot it is but the point is there's no limit there's no right or wrong way to do this but you definitely want to surround yourself with positivity so think out of the box 
um, whether it's on your car, whatever it may be. Surround yourself with positive images so that you can start visualizing the things that you want to see manifest in your life. It's gonna help it take root in your heart. It's also gonna help to push you forward when you wanna quit or when you're tired. It's gonna push you to go that extra mile and keep moving forward. We've probably all worked with a trainer before and you know, or even if you're just in a workout class, you go harder typically than you do if you're at home by yourself when no one can see you. So one thing that you can do right now today to start helping you live that positive life is go ahead and subscribe to this channel if you haven't so that you can get your midday motivation every Monday. And then don't stop there. Follow me on Facebook as well as Instagram at Crystal Clear Hope because throughout the week I hit you with motivational tips, encouraging moments, scripture, um, entrepreneurship tips, health and beauty tips, all of that good stuff so you don't want to miss it. It is a place of positivity. I purposely made the Crystal Clear Hope brand positive. I want it to speak to all things positive. I love you guys. I hope you have an amazing day and just know that you are outstanding and whatever your goals are, you can do it. With God, there are no limits. I love you, I love you, I love you. Did I say I love you? I love you. You have a great day. I am Hope Knows. This has been your Midday Motivation and I will see you the next time. Bye.